What is a nebula? This is a nebula. It may look like a colorful work of art, but it's really a giant cloud of dust and gas in space. Nebulae are far away from Earth. We know what they look like because scientists use powerful telescopes to capture images of them. A nebula can take many different forms and shapes. But where did these stunning dust clouds come from? Some nebulae come from the gas and dust thrown out when a dying star explodes. When a massive star explodes, it's called a supernova. This is an example of what that looks like. Other nebulae are regions where new stars are beginning to form, called star nurseries. How does a nebula make stars? Well, nebulae are made of very spread out dust particles and gases, mostly hydrogen and helium. Gravity begins to pull clumps of dust and gas together inside the nebula. Then, as those clumps grow larger, their gravity gets stronger and stronger. Eventually, a clump of dust and gas gets so big that it collapses from its own gravity. This collapse causes the material at the center of the cloud to heat up, causing the beginning of a star. The closest known nebula to Earth is approximately 700 light years away. It is called the Helix Nebula. The Helix Nebula is the remnant of a dying star, like what will happen to our own sun in a few billion years. Using powerful space telescopes like NASA's Spitzer Space Telescope and Hubble Space Telescope, we have captured images of the Helix Nebula and many others. Scientists will learn more about nebulae with NASA's James Webb Space Telescope. It will be able to look through the dust to see stars forming planetary systems. Learning more about these faraway nebulae help us better understand the life cycle of stars, including our sun, the most important star to our life here on Earth. Learn more about our universe at NASA Space Place.